Hello and welcome to the PC Michiana Tech Help Show. This is episode 26 of the Faster Vista series where we show you how to speed up your Windows Vista operating system quickly if you've got the patience to watch all these videos. <laughs> but they're all short, so you don't really have to be that scared on it. Go ahead and scroll down to the bottom left hand corner. I've got another registry tweak for you today. Select the start button, type in reg edit like we have in the previous two videos. Scroll up to your programs, right click on it, click run as administrator. Now what we're going to do this time is we are going to expand the H key local machine like we did before, then expand system, expand current control set again, then expand control and we want to double click on file system again. We were in here in the previous video, but this time we're interested in NTFS disable last access update, which by default is hopefully set to one. But what we're basically doing is coming in here and making sure it is set to one. What this does is it sets a timestamp each time a file is accessed into your Windows operating system. Now, this isn't the same as your last modified on that you normally see on your files, you want to keep that. That's actually, this is not going to affect that. This is a different feature and it's more for internal and reporting surfaces. Now, if you think this is useless like I do for 95% of you, go ahead and double click on it and select the value data to one if it isn't that already, then select okay. If it's not in here, of course, I'm gonna delete this. If it's not in here, then all you need to do is right click and click new, type in D word, and then what you wanna do is you want to type in NTFS, disable last access update and then press enter double click on it and set the value to one and select OK and that's all there is to this episode if you want to know more about the last access update registry enter entry you can check the video description don't forget to leave comments and ratings and always don't forget to subscribe because it helps me out and YouTube likes subscribers and I have a good chance of someday becoming a non-quite-so-poor partner. Thanks again.